So many people I went to school with. So many people younger than me. So many people that you see like on TV or whatever, like they don't even make it to 30. So I'm very blessed and I'm very grateful. And I'm very thankful. I thank God for this day. I thank God for this opportunity. And I'm always just be proud to say, hey, look how long I lived. I don't care if nobody called me. You would say, oh, you old. At least I live to be old. But I feel good though. Everything still work? Everything still work. Not that. <laughs> Hola, welcome back to T and Lee TV. What you say now? What you do now? T and Lee, and we back with the crew now. Crap shrimp, and you know we review now. Cooking up all this real nice food now. What you said now? What you need now? Look on green screen HD now. Go ahead and subscribe, join the family. T and Lee is the place to be. So welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for joining us. As you can see from the title, today is my birthday. Mm. It's my birthday. Hey. It's my birthday. And I know you've seen something else in the uh, title when you've seen the surprise collaboration. We got some steak and some broccoli right here. And um, hold on, y'all. Come get these vegetables. You know I don't like vegetables like that. Come get them. Come on. Ooh. No, you ain't getting me in trouble. Uh-uh. Last time I had to sit at the table all night long. Mm -mm. Nope. Hey, y'all. It's your girl, Miss Diversity, coming at you. And as you can see, we are doing a birthday collaboration. After you're done watching this TV video, be sure to scroll over to my channel, Miss Adversity 3, and check out my video. And while you're over there, hit the subscribe button. See you then. Bye. So, as you guys can see, I'm doing the collaboration with Miss Diversity 3. Yay! Yes, y'all. If y'all don't know, Miss Diversity 3 is my sister. She's not my YouTube sis. She ain't my sister from another mister. She's my blood sister. We grew up together. And today is my birthday. Tomorrow is her birthday. Y'all, we are Irish twins. We do share uh, we do, we don't, well, we share a birthday in a way because it, they always celebrated our birthday on my birthday. And I know she's a little salty about that. She had a little bit salty, but I can't help it that I appear or something like rabbits. But anyway, on the menu again, I have some New York strip steak and some broccoli and cheese. So let me go ahead and bless the food and let's get into this collab. Lord, I thank you for this food you bless me with. I should bless me as I eat it. Bless me with to my body. Please don't let it hurt from there to cut me for eating this food or drinking this drink. In your son Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to Tinley TV because it is the place to be. Don't forget to check out our sponsors, The Coldest Water. And it's on in the description box as well as the Epic Empire. Today to drink, of course, I have Pepsi. Y'all see how to open it. <laughs> Sorry if I'm looking over here. You done set up this monitor and I can't stop looking at it. You know. <laughs> and then y'all I got in a glass today so I am hungry I have not eaten today and it's late so y'all be seeing this tomorrow around 7 p.m. and then after this I'm gonna go live so the live that you see before this that's after I finish this meal but yes me and my sister decided to collaborate on this doing a birthday collaboration because we both share close birthdays so yeah how this came about mmm How we decided to do this is, growing up, I never wanted the vegetables on my plate. And she never wanted her meat. So we used to sneak. I know my mama watching, but I know she know already. We used to trade, like, be on the table. She's like, I don't want this meat. I'm like, I don't want this vegetable. I'm like, give me a vegetable. And I eat her meat. It was crazy, but that's the way it is. Y'all, this broccoli and cheese, bang it. Mmm. Oh, 
But this was a great idea from Miss Diversity 3. Got my steak. I wanted it medium. I think it's more medium well. Mmm. Mmm. But it's good. I don't have that for y'all. But this this shouldn't be too messy. It was a steak good. So I'm putting some taxi. Y'all know Pepsi is my favorite. Y'all, we had to get a video of the food <laughs> before I brought it to the um, table. But yes, happy birthday to me. I'm so excited. Y'all, I said this birthday, I want to celebrate. Usually, I'll just be like, you know, it's not no big deal. I'll just be chilling. Leo just like cook for me. We might go out. You know, we'll go out. Stuff like that. But I normally be chilling <clears throat> on my birthday. It's just like, it's not like just another day because I am grateful, you know, that I'm blessed to see another year, but sometimes I don't make a big deal of it. Mm. There's a lot of fat on this little end piece. Then my sister would say, she'd be like, give me that fat. I don't want all that. Mm, but it's still good. Y'all need to put some under my plate so it's not wiggling. Y'all just say juicy. Look at it. Can y'all tell? I'm gonna hold it right here. Can you tell it's all juicy? Juicy. Mmm. So, y'all know my favorite steak is a filet mignon, but I don't know what was going on in the store today, but they barely had anything. Everything was like being wiped out. Like, what's going on? Mm -hmm. So, I went with the New York strip. I like New York strip, but it's not as tender, so. I prefer the filet. So, y'all, being that our birthdays are a day apart and mine came first, we always, our parents always used to celebrate <laughs> our birthday. <laughs> On my birthday. So. My sister. Will always say. You stole my shine. You just can't wait one more day. But if I waited with my dad. I would have been born on your birthday. You know we had the same as that birthday. But I guess that would be better than. Me stealing the shine right. She was like, you stole my shine. You came on my birthday. She always tell me, y'all know, you stole everything. You stole the boobs. You stole the booty. You left me with nothing. She said, I left you boobs. I left you booty. <laughs> you just stole everything. And you stole my birthday. <laughs> mm, uncle. But I'm not the culprit. You don't see mom and daddy about that. That was them. Getting busy. Not me. I'm a product of that. I have nothing to do with it. But we always joke about that. 
But she be like, you stole my shine. <laughs> I think it's kind of funny because, I don't know. It's like, I didn't mean to, sorry. So for one day, me and Miss Diversity 3, I always say Keisha because I don't call her Miss Diversity 3, I call her Keisha. Let me call her Keisha all my life. I only say Miss Diversity 3 when I'm referring to her online. <clears throat> mm. So for one day, me and Keisha are the same age. Y'all, we getting up there. By the time you watching this, I'm a whole 37. <laughs> oh my God. And um, for some reason, I've never been afraid to tell my age, like, I'm so grateful, like, so many people just don't even make it to 21, and the fact that I'm blessed to see 37 is just like, wow, am I really that old? <laughs> I don't feel like, mm. the only way I feel it is in my maturity level, like, <clears throat> I just mature more every year. I mature even more. So that's how I know I'm getting older. Not because I feel older or anything. But my mindset continues to change. I continue to learn things. I have like moments like, aha. Uh -huh. That's how I can tell I'm getting older. I know people say their bones be creaking and stuff. I mean, <clears throat> I don't know. I would say my bone creaks. I don't know what that was. I wouldn't say my bones creak or anything. I um, I don't know, cause my my back will hurt if I sleep wrong, but if I don't, I'm fine. I don't know. I'm not feeling it in that way, and, and I'm grateful for that. Hmm. That's a piece of fat. But besides that, I'm fine. I can tell I'm getting older because the things I see, I realize it's God. Will be that dumb? Some of the stuff I know it wasn't that dumb. But only way people think. No, this is good. When I see a younger person thinking a certain way, <clears throat> it's like okay, it's expected. But when I see people my age and older. Or even if you're just in your 30s or in your late 20s. I'm just like, dang. I don't know. I have no understanding. I just, I guess, I think. <clears throat> Excuse me. Niecy Burt. <laughs> Let me stop. Akisha said I stole that too. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> yeah, I'm still a little hoarse. <laughs> My voice, I don't know. This sickness <clears throat> is still like having an effect in some ways on me. Ugh, I'm so over it. But I feel like once you get <sighs> this, so so to give you the burps. Sorry, over the age of 25, I just start looking at you different. I just do. Like, come on now, because I feel like if by 25. You don't got it together somewhat. I feel like you'll never get it. Especially if you're a woman. Y'all the dog barking. 
Naya! Ma? Why are the dogs back there? I hear somebody sound like a truck. Mmm. Mmm. Babe. Come here. Uh, you gotta taste this. This is what? Listen. Y'all, we gotta taste this. You think so? I'm good, though. You like it? Mm -hmm. Y'all, this is good. I didn't know if it was just me. Y'all know he picky. I'm picky too, but. Uh -huh. <laughs> good. <laughs> I can't offer him no steak because you like his steak well done. I'm not medium well. I said medium well. Mm hmm. Or medium well. But, you know, everybody different, I guess. I don't know. Just to me, like, once you get past 25 and you do stupid stuff, it's like, not that it's ever cute, but it's really just not cute anymore. Like, it's just like you're dumb. And you ain't gonna never grow up. That's how I felt after I turned 25. It's like you're young, but you're too old. We act like it. But so many people I went to school with, so many people younger than me, so many people that you see like on TV or whatever, like they don't even make it to 30. So I'm very blessed and I'm very grateful and I'm very thankful. I thank God for this day. I thank God for this opportunity. And I'm always just be proud to say, hey, look how long I lived. I don't care if nobody called me. You would say, oh, you old. <laughs> At least I live to be old. But I feel good, though. Everything still work? Everything still work. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> mm. So, I wonder how, what kind of state Mr. Versus 3 is. Mmm. Y'all, I season this steak with some nature seasoning, which is basically like salt and pepper and something and some other stuff. But it's not salty like salt. I use a little bit of garlic and accent <clears throat> and <clears throat> but you can omit the accent though some people are sensitive to MSG but then I put some soy on there some uh, low sodium soy sauce um, I also put some Worcestershire sauce and I put some teriyaki sauce Walmart well, has this teriyaki sauce I don't really taste the teriyaki sauce. I put it on there. I don't know. I don't really taste it. Mm. 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 I don't taste like a sweetness. I probably have to put a lot. Because even Jelena tried it one time. She was like, she can't really taste it. Because she was the one that opened it. <clears throat> she was like, can I try this? I was like, sure. I asked her how she liked it. She was like, she don't even know if she tasted it. And I've used it before. That's something else. So, I don't know. Maybe I have to use more. Probably just not that strong. But it was good though. Mmm. -hmm. Y'all, I like the broccoli. Just as so much as the steak. Mm. <laughs> mm hmm. Tomorrow? 
Sorry, y'all. In the end of the video, he coming up with ideas, y'all. <clears throat> I'm gonna have a good time tomorrow for my birthday. Well, today's my birthday, as y'all see. So I'm having a good time today. As you watching this, I'm having a real good time. I just want to celebrate and enjoy life. And I just feel like this year for my birthday. I want to have a good time. Mm. Y'all. Yeah. I truly, truly, truly enjoy this. And y'all, this man is so hard and keto friendly. So you can eat this with no guilt. Mmm. Meals like this, I could do. Mm hmm. Maybe not this part, though. <laughs> There's a sugar in here. <clears throat> Last bite of broccoli. Mmm. Mm -hmm. mm. That was it out. So, I appreciate y'all joining us. Or me. This was a meal fit for a queen. All right, y'all. So thank you so much for joining me for my birthday mukbang. Thank you so much for subscribing to Teen Lee TV because it is the place to be. Don't forget, whenever you're done with this video, go on over to my sister's channel, Miss Diversity 3. See how she did her steak and broccoli and cheese. You will not regret it. She has such a fun and bubbly personality. And that's my sister. And I love her. And happy birthday to you, sister, because yours is tomorrow. So now it's time to go jump on the bed. That's the inside thing, but I'll let y'all in on it. When we were younger, when we both were the same age, we used to jump on the bed. And it was like, we're six for a day. We're six for a day because we both would be six years old. It was crazy, but that's something we did. So let's go jump on the bed, sissy. I'm waiting for you. Again, don't forget to uh, check out the code is water. The link is in the description box down below. It's so Naya. Her link is down there as well as the Epic Empire. Thank you so much for all the birthday wishes that I've received thus far. I really, really appreciate y'all and I love y'all so much. So until next time, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I will see you on the next video. It's time to keep partying. Hi, y'all. Peace.